Okay, there are going to be some changes around here. We're getting a little bit of drizzle into the area right now, some low cloud cover. A little patchy drizzle will continue, and then it becomes more of a light rain after midnight uh, as it starts to move on in, but not widespread, not very heavy rainfall. And then this weekend, consecutively, sunny, chilly, breezy, then sunny, chilly, not so breezy over the weekend. This is going to be the coldest temperature. These are going to be the coldest temperatures uh, we've seen since last April 8th. Uh, so it'll be chilly outside, especially during uh, the day tomorrow. With the breeze uh, through the trees. Next week, lots of rain again are coming up on Tuesday. And after that, it'll likely be even colder than what we see this weekend coming up for Wednesday. Now, we've got a little drizzle right now. And there's that little bit of light rain, a little bit steadier rain. That's likely to drop on through a little bit later on after midnight. Big picture tells a story. Low pressure here. Cold front is going to drop on through. There's the rain from earlier in the day moving, especially through the peninsula with some heavy rain at times. Uh, and then just a stray shower or two. Nothing too terribly big moving on in during the overnight hours. But we'll have lots of changes for the day tomorrow. Here's where we are at midnight. Just a stray shower to there, here and there. Right now it's 56 by 4 o'clock 54 and that's going to be the high for the day likely four or five o'clock in the morning because after that the rain comes to an end skies have almost cleared by then uh, still some cloud cover to the south side eastern north carolina a little bit of rain into north carolina but basically a sunshiny day rather breezy High temperatures right around 50 in the middle of the afternoon. Our official high will likely be around 54, uh, but that will happen in the pre-dawn hours. Then during the day on Sunday, we start the day 28, 32 well inland, 36, 37, 38 near the shoreline. A breeze near the shoreline holds the temperature up just a bit there. And then during the afternoon, again, only around 49, 50 degrees. Not much wind going on from there. Now, Monday will warm back on up into the 50s, but rain again at the end of the day. Remember I talked about rain for Tuesday? Tuesday. Here it is Tuesday morning. Here it is Tuesday evening and then a cool front comes through and by Wednesday morning we've got temperatures in the 40s and they just stay there all day long for the day on Wednesday. So lots of changes. The changes begin first thing tomorrow. We'll see 54 in the pre-dawn hours but temperatures are going to be dropping during the day and it'll likely be only around 49, 50 in the afternoon and breezy. So that'll be the more uncomfortable day. For Sunday, Veterans Day, we're looking at 49 for a high but not much wind wind at all during the day. Lots of sunshine uh, for Monday. We'll end up with sunshine, some late day cloud cover and perhaps even a shower at the end of the day on Monday, giving way to some rain overnight Monday night, certainly into the day on Tuesday and it comes to an end, but really plummets for temperature by Wednesday. We'll see some nighttime lows uh, uh, below freezing, uh, for example, tomorrow night uh, uh, in the inland areas. We were looking so forward to fall. Didn't need to speed toward winter.